Hey everybody, it's John here from Gimiac.com. Here we are today in the Hour of the Witch DLC for Dead by Daylight going for the Humanitarian Achievement. This is to apply 50 buffs on fellow survivors. This one's going to be done from the survivor side. You can use whoever you want for this achievement, but typically you're going to probably want to use the DLC's character, who is going to be Michaela. Michaela is going to have two abilities that you can use for this achievement, Circle of Healing and Shadow Step. Both of these are going to be boon abilities, so what you want to do is you want to make sure you start up the game. Once you get into the game, your goal is to look for a totem, and then once you find the totem, you want to make sure you bless it. And then once you bless the totem, anyone within the vicinity of the totem is going to gain these two abilities and then that's going to give you the count towards the achievement. So just make sure you throw one up and then hopefully you have your other teammates pass by sometime during the game and then as long as it stays up and people are coming within its area you should be good to work on the achievements in the background. Now, for whatever reason, if you don't want to drop the cash on the in-game shop or the DLC pack for the character, you can also do this with any other character. My personal recommendation is going to be Ace. The reason I recommend Ace is you want to make sure you use these two perks. You want to make sure you use Open Handed and Up the Ante. Start up the game once you have those two equipped, and these two perks, thankfully, are also going to apply buffs to your fellow teammates. And the cool thing about these is it should affect all of your teammates at the start of the game, and you don't have to do anything. It's going to be passive. So as long as you get into a game with these two perks equipped, you should apply both of them to all three of your teammates at the start, and you should get a free six to count towards the achievement. So if you are just focused on the achievement, what you can do is you can just equip these two perks on Ace and just keep starting up games with him. No matter the results, as long as you get your free six at the beginning, you can whittle this down in a few games. Whatever you decide to do, once you get to 50 buffs total, you should be good for the achievement. There it is. It's going to be for 10 gamer score. And that's all there is to it.